welcome back to the brand new video. We've got the top 40. We're wrapping it up. 2024 tops is slated to be here on Wednesday. I think I'm going to be able to get at least my preview boxes tomorrow and bring you that video. But officially, there's today, tomorrow, and Wednesday. So three more videos to do in our top 40 countdown. Coming in at number three is Museum Collection. We'll open this box up in just one minute. But first, I just want to let you know that, hey, we're live tonight on the youtube channel here with a live auction we're giving this away it's a 700 dollars for Fernando tatis painting all you have to do is be subscribed to my channel subscribe to ike ike's art studios on instagram and leave a comment from this past sunday's video which is about the tristar show and we're going to select one of the, you folks from uh left a comment all you have to do is you know simply leave a comment and we'll just pick one of you we'll send you that 700 dollars painting courtesy of ike we're also giving away this one this is a bigger one it is a 1980 Tops design, Ronald Acuna Jr. This is only going to be given away to people that are in our break tomorrow. So if you'd like to, or not tomorrow, yeah, I guess it would be tomorrow. 2024 Tops Series 1, Team Break Tuesday. We're hoping we get all our cases in tomorrow. If not, we'll wrap it up on Wednesday. But uh, if you buy a spot in our 2024 Tops breaks, your name goes in the hat for this one. This is a $1,000 painting. It's a little bit larger. And uh, I bought that one from Ike this past December in uh, hopes of giving it away in conjunction with Series 1. But anyway, let's go into Museum Collection now. I hope that you uh, want to, um, I hope you guys win those paintings out there. Well, someone will. But Caleb, this is for you. And Caleb is one of our Patreon members. If you'd like to sponsor a video like this one, support the channel, get into the breaks, check us out on Patreon. All right, Museum Collection, here we go. It's about a $400 box. The price on this started off at 400 It dropped down to like 320 a couple months ago. It's back up around almost 400 again. It's a pretty popular product. You get two autographs per box. Also, two relics. One of those relics will be a quad relic. Four pieces of material. All right, here we go. One of my favorites. Let's see what we can find for Caleb. Just two products left to do from 2023. We'll also have Diamond Icons coming soon from 2023. A new release preview video of Diamond Icons. We'll get that probably put up here on the channel maybe within the next couple days. Hopefully we have, there's two boxes in a case of Diamond Icons. The first box is all sold out. The second box is about half sold out or so. So if you want to grab a spot over on Patreon and Diamond Icons, please feel free. All right, Caleb, here we go. Here is mini box number one. Let's see what we've got here on this Monday. Yeah, mystery box Monday will be coming along a little bit later tonight, right before we go live with our auction. So we've got Tom Seaver starting us off. Clayton Kershaw is there. There's Bobby Witt Jr. And we are going to start off with, oh boy, we've got a J-Rod for you, Caleb. Julio Rodriguez on card auto numbered to 20 numbered one of 20 that is a fantastic hit i think there's no doubt that museum collection definitely belongs in the top five of any product listing for 2023 products i love this product this is a great card that's one of the better cards we pulled from museum collection very nice card he was actually my pick he's my he is my pick to be the American League most valuable player this year with Shohei Otani out and moving over to the National League. I think it's J-Rods for the taking. So we'll see. There's obviously other great players in there as well. Bobby Witt Jr. had a great second half. I think he's going to do very well. Aaron Judge could hit 60-some home runs again. Corey Seager, but uh, I've got J-Rod. He's my pick. So, man, Caleb, congratulations on that one, numbered to 20. So there's an autograph out of the way, everybody. Let's see what else we can find. There's, By the way, there will be another autograph. It'll be a relic auto. My, man, my, my box stopper might need a little fine tuning here. We'll have a relic autograph. We'll have a relic and we'll have a quad relic coming up momentarily. Let's get into this next one and see what we've got here. In mini box number two, we've got Kyle Tucker on the back and on the front. Kyle Tucker, lots of talk down in Houston about him getting signed. He's under contract for two more years, but... I think the Astros would like to lock him and or Bregman up. Bregman's contract is up after this year. We've got Vaughn Grissom right there. Then we have a canvas collection. Miguel Vargas, rookie card, and then the hit here. It's going to be Jake McCarthy. It's the relic. It's low numbered at least. Numbered to 15, so that's not bad. And the Kyle Tucker is going to be numbered to just 
$2.99. All right, so let's see what else we have for Caleb. Next box up. Whoa, whoa, getting a little too feisty with the uh, blade right there. Yeah, definitely need to get the new blade in there. You'll see that uh, didn't even nick the, uh, the package, though. Just barely broke through. Here we go. Let's see what we've got for Caleb. I feel pretty bad if I did. Also, the Pops Report is coming up tonight. It's back. A lot of people were a little concerned the Pops Report was going away or maybe going quarterly, but the January Pops Report from Pops Dyer will be tonight. Let's see what we have in this next one. It's Babe Ruth and... Byron Buxton, for a second there, I thought it was Bryce Harper. I saw the B, I saw the Y, I saw the R. Byron Buxton numbered to 199. He had a rough season last year. He was kind of plagued with injuries, doing a lot of DH duty instead of playing center field. But he's a solid, uh, when he's healthy, solid player. So not a bad autograph right there. Twins fans will definitely like that one. And we're left with our quad relic. Here we go. Very last one. This one will feature one relic one card with four pieces of memorabilia. I'm hopeful that it's going to be four different players. There's some really nice quad relics. All right, I just have to retire that blade. All right, I think I think we pulled we pulled a good one from this product a while ago. It was I think maybe it was the preview video. I think it was like Juan Soto, Ronald Acuna Jr., Vladimir Guerrero Jr., and maybe somebody else. Some other big name. So here we go. Final one of this video. Let's see what we've got. We've got Oswald Parasa on the back. And on the front, we've got our second Miguel Vargas sighting of the day. There's Ichiro. He'll be a headliner in the next year's Hall of Fame class. Ichiro Suzuki most hits all time by any professional, if you include his Japanese league stats in there. There's Juan Soto. He'll be playing with the Yankees. I'm going to have to keep a close eye on his rookie cards and see if they're going up because if he starts mashing in small Yankee Stadium along with Oswald Peraza there, then those cards are going to go way up. And the Peraza is numbered to 299. So nice numbered card. And here we go. Final hit of this one. Thanks very much for watching. Again, we have an auction tonight. I hope you can join us for it. It'll be part some of the stuff that I picked up at recent card shows and then part consignment as well. We had two consignments come in this week, one from Dante and one from, uh, I think, Carter's Cards. What do we got? So check us out for that. Also, Mystery Box Monday coming a little bit later. Four pieces of memorabilia. I couldn't really tell you who it is based off of that memorabilia. It's all white. It's open for like a team color or something. But here we go. It is going to be... Oh, it's Kyle Tucker. We just talked about him. So three Kyle Tucker cards in this box. And this one is numbered to 20. Kyle Tucker, I mean, he's probably going to want $300 million as an extension because I think if you look at his OPS numbers amongst right fielders, He's right up there with uh, Judge and Betts and all those guys that have big, big deals. So Astros, you better, better pony up. Open up the pocketbook for Kyle Tucker if you're going to sign him long term. So, Caleb, good box. Headlined especially by that Julio Rodriguez. So thank you very much for watching, everybody. Make sure you're subscribed to this channel. Hit that red button and uh, have a shot at this Fernando Tatis painting. Also, if you're a channel member, I posted a new series that only members can see. Channel Member Monday is uh, live on the channel right now. Just kind of like a behind the scenes stuff. Some uh, kind of like a vlog. It's just not, uh, there's a little bit of baseball cards in there, but it's just kind of like day to day life of uh, just uh, us going out and doing stuff, watching the Super Bowl, um, stuff like that. So thanks for those of you that are channel members. If you'd like to become a channel member, hit that join button. We'd love to have you along. Also, it gives you an extra uh, 30 minutes to an hour of bidding time during the auctions and a free pack of cards. If you're a channel member with every win during that extra channel member only time. So I hope to see you in the auction tonight. Thanks for watching and I'll see you all later. Good night, everybody.